In other news, North Korean leader Kim Jong-un has called for the strengthening of his regime's military capabilities to counter what he insists are, quote, hostile forces against the North. But he has also underlined that the move is not aimed at Seoul or Washington. Our North Korean affairs correspondent Kim Dami reports. The North's leader Kim Jong-un has criticized the U.S., saying that there are no grounds to believe Washington is not hostile toward Pyongyang. According to the North State Media on Tuesday, Kim made the statement Monday in a speech at a defense development exhibition to mark the 76th founding anniversary of the ruling Workers' Party. He went on to accuse Washington of creating tensions on the Korean Peninsula and said such tensions will not be easily resolved because of the U.S. Kim also denounced Asar for being, quote, hypocritical and having double standards for continuing to boost military capabilities. Kim Jong-un then pointed out that strengthening national defense is the regime's number one priority. Yet, he made sure to note that such a move is not intended to target a specific country like the South or the U.S., adding that the North's main enemy is war itself. He then added that the horrific history of using armaments against the same people on the peninsula should not be repeated. Gim's speech came less than two weeks after the North test-fired a new anti-aircraft missile in what was its fourth missile launch in September alone. There was a no military parade to mark the founding anniversary on Sunday. Instead, Kim Jong-un delivered a speech that he will work towards improving his people's living conditions, pledging to resolve issues related to food, clothing and shelter for the next five years. Kim Dami, Arirang News.